at the top tonight busted at a Valley Strip Club. A mom pulls her 14-year-old son out, and Channel 5 cameras are rolling. Eddie Flores was there when it all went down. He joins us live. Eddie, why was a 14-year-old kid in a strip club in the first place? Oh, well, the boy is a runaway who was somehow able to get in. The mother says she tried to go through the proper channels, uh, trying to get someone to help her pull her underage son out of the strip club. But in the end, she took matters into her own hands. I haven't seen him. I don't know where he's at. Viviana Lozano says she tried getting the law to help her pull her 14-year-old son out of this strip club located on Highway 107 north of Mission. I've been trying to get a, a officers to help me take my son out of there and somehow or the other sheriff department has refused um, to help me and I have my calling PD and they just said that is not their area. So this mother decided to go to the club and take matters into her own hands. We followed Lozano to the strip club. She and another male family member went inside to pull the 14 year old boy out. Minutes later, they came out with the runaway boy, although he struggled for a while to try and get away. He was sitting in one of the front rows. There was um, a couple of girls there. They were dancing, and I guess sometimes people have to take things into their own matters, and, and this is what I'm doing. We walked to the front door of the strip club to confront the management ourselves. He's 14 years old. He was at a, in the front, and they took him out. And now they have water. He was in there. He was inside the club. Did you see him in here? We saw the parents no, 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 come in there. Did you see him in here? Did you see him in here? We saw the parents come did take him out. Did you see him in here, sir? I'm trying to answer that. The reason we did see him in here is because they walked in alone. They walked in alone. Oh, the lines in my face. After a few minutes, the manager came back outside and talked with us a bit more calmly. I do apologize, please. I do apologize. I mean, I don't know who it was, man. Okay? I wasn't here. But you do apologize. I will, but I will make sure it never happens again. Okay. None like that will happen again. I guarantee you that. You got that. Because whoever let it happen is not going to be here by tomorrow. Well, Lozano says her son is now at MHMR for a mental health evaluation. She says she's sending him to the Texas Adolescent Treatment Center in San Antonio. As for the strip club, as you just heard yourself, they said this kind of thing will never happen again. Eddie Florida,